Hey everyone, today's Funko Pop review will be a vision from the Avengers Age of Ultron series. And of course, this figure is based off of the Vision character from the upcoming movie Avengers Age of Ultron. Alright, let's break this figure down. Like all Marvel figures, he is a bobblehead. Um, he also has really nice clean eyes, which is what I look for in my figures. You might not notice, but there is a light gray rim that surrounds the eyes that kind of make them pop. Um, it's a really cool feature. Also, he has headgear that wraps all around his head. Um, there's not too much detail to it, but I mean, it's interesting. Uh, there's no splatter, no smudging. So overall, it's a really nice paint job. Uh, granted, it's really basic, but it looks pretty good. He's even got his little robot goatee. Now, movie prediction. I think that the gem on top of Vision's head, which is normally a thing that he can shoot lasers out of, will actually be an infinity stone that will be used later on in the movie series. All right, and as for the body sculpt, not a lot going on. Uh, he has these pink gloves and boots, and he has a gray um, shirt on. But uh, where his cape connects to his body, there's a little bit of a uh, gold texture, almost like they're uh, not buttons, but like bolts that keep them on. So there's a little detail going there. There's no smudging or anything. Um, also, on his main body, there seem to be like grooves. Um, if you can't really tell from the video, but there's a texture to his body that kind of goes all the way from the chest to the legs and to the arms. Um, and that's only in the gray areas. Now, um, if you look at his gloves, you can see that there's a bit of gold um, where the, I assume that the gloves would attach. So those are pretty interesting, considering that the original vision is red and green instead of pink and gray. Um, but that's, you know, movie rights. When you move on to the cape, uh, an interesting thing is he has a little bit of, like, texture going on in the back of the cape um, since he's, like, a robot superhero. But uh, where there seems to be this orange fade, it's where it's transparent. You can um, actually see through it. Um, another little interesting thing I found out is that the exclusive figures that you can buy where the vision is actually a transparent, um, like from his waist to his torso, it's all um, a see-through kind of uh, plastic. Fortunately, I didn't get that one, but uh, hopefully here in the near future I can find one at uh, C2E2 and I can add that to my collection. While Vision isn't the most exciting figure I've ever reviewed, he is definitely one of the most well done and I'm very pleased with the way that this figure came out. Alright, thanks for watching my Funko Pop review. If you liked this video, hit the subscribe button and also check out some of our other Avengers Age of Ultron Funko Pop reviews. And don't forget to follow us on social media, links are in the description down below.